Welcome to Academic Game Tutorials. In this video we will look into the effect of hot working on mechanical properties of metals, so make sure to watch the full video to get a clear concept. In hot working, the temperature of completion of metal working is important since any extra heat left after working aid in grain growth. This increase in size of the grains occurs by a process of coalescence of adjoining grains and is a function of time and temperature. When we look into the effect of hot working on mechanical properties of metals, the essential points include. Number 1, this process is generally performed on a metal held at such a temperature that the metal does not work harden. A few metals, for example, lead and tin possess low crystallization temperatures so they can be hot worked at room temperature. Number 2, raising the metal temperature lowers the stresses required to produce deformations and increases the possible amount of deformation before excessive work hardening takes place. Number 3, hot working is preferred where large deformations have to be performed that do not have the primary purpose of causing work hardening. Number 4, hot working produces the same net results on a metal as cold working and annealing. It does not strain harden the metal. Number 5. In hot working processes, compositional irregularities are ironed out and non-metallic impurities are broken up into small, relatively harmless fragments, which are uniformly dispersed throughout the metal instead of being concentrated in large stress-raising metal working masses. Number 6. Hot working such as rolling process refines grain structure. The coarse columnar dendrites of cast metal are refined to smaller acquiesced grains with corresponding improvement in mechanical properties of the component. Number 7. Surface finish of hot worked metal is not nearly as good as with cold working, because of oxidation and scaling. Number 8. One has to be very careful as regards the temperatures at which to start hot work and at which to stop because this affects the properties to be introduced in the hot worked metal. Number 9. Too high a temperature may cause phase change and overheat the steel whereas too low temperature may result in excessive work hardening. Number 10. Defects in the metal such as blowholes, internal porosity and cracks get removed or welded up during hot working. And finally number 11. During hot working, self-annealing occurs and recrystallization takes place immediately following plastic deformation. This self-annealing action prevents hardening and loss of ductility. So, we have discussed about the effect of hot working on mechanical properties of metals in details, thank you.